The British government is racist. Last week, Boris Johnson boasted that 50 people seeking refuge in Britain have been told they will be sent to Rwanda. It's the first step of the Tories' plan to deport vulnerable asylum seekers crossing the channel to a country they've never been to, thousands of miles away. For years, the right-wing media have whipped up hatred and fear of refugees. We've seen journalists in boats reaching migrants who are arriving on dinghies, and instead of helping them, counting them. And despite horrifying tragedies, this hysteria has only got worse. Now their cruelty has reached new heights. They pretend it's about protecting people, but we know better. When white Ukrainians need refuge, the government rightly opens the door. But when black and brown people risk their lives in pursuit of a better, safer life, the Tories deport them. I want to ask everyone here I stay in Europe, why for from Africa I stay in where and from Ukraine I stay in hotel. It's racism, pure and simple. They want to divide us. While their rich mates get richer, they want the millions struggling in a Tory cost of living crisis to blame someone else. But the enemy of the working class arrives by private jet and not migrant dinghy. Together, we are fighting back. We're demonstrating in the streets. We're challenging them in the courts. We're resisting racist immigration raids in our communities. And we're fighting for a socialist immigration policy within the Labour Party. Please get involved, share this video.